What is up, YouTube? Nick here for the hashtag Very Cool Guys. I got some, some other guys over my shoulder. What's up, everybody? But you know what today is. It's Furious Friday. Oh, I'm Furious. And that means it's tool war time. And we got a heavyweight championship fight today. So we decided that we wanted to run our Gen 3 Milwaukee. If you haven't seen previous tool wars or the previous tool war that featured this. We'll put a link to that video here. It also will be in that playlist, weights and measures, talks all about the drill, an unboxing, all kinds of cool videos. Go check it out over there. It's not there right now, though, because we're videoing live. A lot of people like recently been asking, hey, I go to click that video when you click, there's nothing there. It's because it's not there yet because we're live, but later on, it will be there. You can go and check it out. So today, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be running this in the tool war, we got a, it's a, a distant cousin. It's a relative. It's another TTI offering from Ryobi. A lot of you on the channel have been saying that, hey, Vince, yeah, you don't give any love to the other TTI brands like Ryobi. And what's that other one? Rigid. 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 And Rigid. So today we have, the, this is the Ryobi. It's the, it's the one plus hammer drill. Got to tell you, it's got some pretty impressive stats, statistics. 18 volts of power. It does. They have a big Ryobi. A lot of people, at least I did for a while there, failed to realize that they have a very, very, it's one of the largest, not, not contractor grade, but DIYer it has one of the largest 18 volt platforms in the industry. Pretty cool. So we want to see how... These are distant relatives, but they're definitely, this is a contract grade tool. This is a DIYer grade tool, but we want to see comparison. How will it do against something like the Gen 3? Carlos De La Cruz was here first. I want to clarify that. A is here. The vlogger was second. Sean McLaughlin's here. Firefighter 1241 is here. Phil Bordreau, Kevin Smith. Our paintball pros here. Whoa! Eggs every day is here. What's up, Aaron? Aaron H. Phil Bordreau. Phil Perkins here. Blair Stone's here. Come on. Hey. We're ceremon we're Junior gonna, Souse is we're gonna, here. We're going to ceremoniously drive drive our, our, our legs in to secure the two by fours. This is just like our This, this is where we ceremoniously do this in the beginning of every. What will we do if we're not doing drills that day? It's a good question, right? I think we can still do it. Cutting okay, something. Cutting something. David Arvalos here. Overpowered here. I need, all right, on the count of three and, and a go. Very cool, gang. I need to go after this three. You guys ready? Hey, you one. Doing? You want one or two? I'm on one. So am I. One, two, three. Go. Wow, it's like the underdog start, man. Unbelievable. Who's the Rudy instead of the Rudy. <laughs> the Rudy. Hold, hold this one. It doesn't move. I'm like, not. Mary Jo's here. The Saint 222 is here. What's up? Jonathan M's here. There we go. What's up, everybody? Glad you're here. Do we, do we, is that a one? That is a win for Ryobi. The Rudy. Rudy. The Ryobi says Jonathan M. Yes. So that is the Ryobi. Ryobi pulled ahead. Now, what is it? I think we got to just go through the normal. Because th these two tools, although they are classified as the same thing, they are on different ends of the spectrum. So I think we have to start with our normal screwdriving tasks. What do you think? I agree. What does the very cool gang think? What do you guys want to see first? Let me know. Saying about this thing. You take this handle. Rob E, what's up, Rob uh, E? I want you all to notice the difference here. The difference between pro like DIY, not even pro so DIY and contractor grade. We have an all we have an all metal handle here that quickly will attach and detach to the tool. The Ryobi, we have <laughs> we have a hex like a, a cutout. What is it even called? I forget what it's called. We get we, it gets supplied with a bolt that fits in there. And then this 
that Jimmy John hex end hand guard fits there, and then this goes on here. Does it work? Yeah, it works. You know, but you can see there is some assembly I required. I feel like if I put some pressure on that, then I can snap it off. What's up, Koof? I'm sure you will. Well, I'm not going to. I'm going to try not to. Eliku Finn, what's up? What's up, Eliku? Richard Garner's here. Richard Garner, I know this is gonna make you happy. Tell him, tell him, Ryobi's have one nothing. Richard, Ryobi's winning. We got, we got your alien green here, Richard. Okay. Now, when did it go from the blue and yellow to the green? That's way more. You'd have to ask. <laughs> you'd have to ask Richard Garner. Richard Garner, I, I do not know. Is the resident Ryobi expert. Cody Gorsuch, what's up? Everybody is shocked that you shaved. Do you have any comments about yeah. your shave? Who, me? Yes. I woke up this morning and decided to shave. I mean, I just, you know, sorry. So I think I win the uh, the beard war this week. Yes. How old do I look now? I only still, I, do I look just 50? Jonathan M. says he has that drill in, uh, in his garage. This drill? Yes. He says it's broke. That's Not it. a good sign. What are you going to do? Aaron H. says 12. I can tell you. What's up, Craig Condit? I do like... I like the, this say is you a, look this younger is a, than me. I like the sleeve. This is a Ryobi, a big kit. I do like the sleeve, and I like that it's magnetic. I like the shield for the screws. You know, if you if you need to do one handed operation with now this is this is a Dewalt feature for the longest time. But if one hand operation up high, okay, with a longer type screw, you can always throw the shield on, and it will help guide the screw while you get set. Or if you're if you're a little bit like you know a novice, as a non pro, I can appreciate the shield. Chris Thorndike, GT says he says Philip Bordeaux, four ninety nine. Put the Ryobi down and get you a the wall. Philip Bordeaux, we appreciate the help with the with the channel, and as you can tell, we're constantly bringing in new tools, new bits, lag screws, wood. Philip Bordeaux, thank you for helping with the show today. We appreciate it. I got to tell you, we appreciate that, Philip Bordeaux. I watch Vince uh, day in, day out, Vin, uh, every week. He puts money out of his own pocket to make all this stuff happen. None of this would happen without him, and uh, this can be really expensive. So, It is. <laughs> David Arivalo. Dora Dana, what's up? So, so I I'm going to um, I'm, I'm gonna start out. I'm going to drill. Straight up and down. So I'm going to go sideways. You can do whatever okay. you want. Because I, I think there's a benefit to that. Is that built for the human hand? How does that feel? I'm going to be honest with you. I'm, I'm, I didn't expect much. I'm not thrilled with the form of this. It's kind of chunky, kind of beefy. Big, huge battery, and it's only a four amp hour. If if I'm used to I'm used to my DeWalt's, which are much lighter. Um, this I could see this becoming cumbersome, especially later on in the day if I was working eight hours a day with this thing. But it's not it's not terrible. Cody Gorsuch, you didn't have to do that, man. We appreciate it. Four ninety nine. We can help put some money back in the channel. The Yo, shades, Cody, man. We appreciate that, man. Why don't you go buy some t-shirts? And we really do. And also, if you if you if you you know, we appreciate the super chats. They help. They do. And also, if you wanted a win win situation where you're giving something to the channel, but you're getting something in return besides a great show, you could also go to the merch store at VCG Construction forward slash store. You can buy hats, buy shirts. You can buy stickers. Yeah, really, <laughs> really cool <laughs> stuff on there. So you can also do that. This way you're helping the channel and you're getting something for it as well. Come on, let's run this test. Come on. We got five screws, inch and a quarter. Let's see who get the chore done first. What are you, what are you doing? Like pushing me out of Oh, the did you see the magnetic feature on the, on, the, on the front of that drill? I did. There you go. That's also pretty nice. That way you don't need to fumble with your screws. Oh, I'm going to use it then. <laughs> yeah. Okay. You want me to? You want me to go over on the no, other I'm side of you? Here, yeah. oh, all right, are I'm you just checking. Trying to move me out of here. Uh, you're, you're, you're getting a little bigger, so I'm on the end. What do you want me to do? You have to big, oh. I'm not sure, Stuart Byron. We're both on one. You sent merch to the UK. No, I'm sorry. We're all, we only we, it, 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 we literally got too expensive. We were selling. We were sending merch to the UK. It got too expensive. We we limit the store to. The United States. I'm sorry. Sorry about that story, Byron. You but go, you go send a super chat. Yeah. <laughs> or we just have to charge more for shipping him. Yeah, I don't. All right, on the count of three and a go. One, two, three. Go.
Millie Walker. It's a good thing. Millie Walker. Thank you, William Davis. That's a really awesome comment, man. What do you say? William? Appreciate it. So you guys are awesome. You're so dedicated to all of us and the tool world. He I says. appreciate that, Billy Davis. I will tell you something here, though. All right. Give me five. I actually kind of like the that feature. That's not a bad idea. <laughs> man, and I like that bit. Too. I like the bit. I told that you. That bit's pretty cool. I like the sleeve. I like the bit. I mean, I'm not. You know, I like that. Coop said he wants a black polo shirt. That's what he wants. Okay. And why is that drill on low mode, Jonathan M? Both drills are on, on one. We have both drills on one. Uh, yeah, you can tell the speed difference. Now, we can, we can run Thanks, two, Stuart Byron. But we always start out at one. Philip or drill. Man, this is, this is chunky. Is I, it, I will say this. It's cumbersome? I'm not – I don't love the way this number two bit fits this drill, uh, this number two screw. That's a pretty cool kit, though. Yeah, it's the same one. Woo! I'm not, I'm, I think I was cheating. I'm not necessarily loving that. Also, I want to mention, guys, if you didn't know, we're, we're running a giveaway for 9,000 subscribers. If you guys haven't seen that video, it'll be linked somewhere around here. Post-production, not right now, but you have a chance to win this Milwaukee M18 Fuel one-key combo kit. It yeah. is Gen 2. Gen 2. We're clearing out the Gen 2s to make way for the Gen 3s. All right. On the count of three. Get yeah, call go while he's... One, his phone's ringing. two, three. I don't think it's going to matter. You're going to win either way. I don't know about that. I like that bit. Go. It does look like a Transformer. Look like a Transformer? <laughs> yeah. It's a, and the Milwaukee's a Decepticon. Dan Sider home. What's up, William? Man, I was close, though. It was pretty close, right? I dropped the screw. What's this? Uh, I, saw, I got something. I got a cheater over here. Yeah. Was that was that Milwaukee? Yeah. Yeah, Milwaukee round three. All right, now let's let's let you want to try it on, on speed two. Yeah, take your Milwaukee back though. Okay, not my fault. The coop says later, crease. What's up, Dan? Dan Soderholm is here. Who's leaving? Oh, oh this better. Yo, King of the Crease can't stay around. He's got to work tonight. Oh, man. Stinks. Yeah, but that's, he's, he's getting over OT. I hope. Keeping that tight group. Yes. I, I do keep, yo. I keep, always tight group. Always, my, we always keep our groups tight. We're weekend warriors. Looks like the Ryobi is on low, says Cody Gorsuch. They're both on one. They're literally are we going one. to two for these screws? No, we're going to stay on one because these are longer yeah. and stronger. They're going to take, you know what I mean? They're going to take more torque. Why is this on two? Was that on two last time? No. Why did it move? I think you moved it when you asked people if you wanted You people are tricky. We'll have to look at the replay. What's up, Electro Welder? Electro Welder, I'm going to need a go from you on the count of three. One, two, three. Go. What's up, Daniel Gomez? Done. Milwaukee. Heads and tails. Whoa. You liking that? What happened with that? Is that the tip? Yeah. What's up, Husky Rider? Yeah. Husky Rider's here. Husky Varna. Husky Varna, yes. It, yeah. It's supposed to be. Yeah. He yeah, says impressive. Up. What's up, Ben Sheps? Ben Sheps is here. Watch out, Ben. It's holding it, its own. It's whole, it's whole Strip tip. Mm. William Davis. LOL Nick, says Carlos De La Cruz. Thanks, Carlos. How are you, Carlos? How are you, Coop? How are you, damn, dar 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 darn Dan Soderholm? Uh, farm Boss is here. What's up? What's up, Farm Boss? Spider. Yes. A little bit at the end. Vince took a little bit off the top and the sides. Yeah. <laughs> All right. 
Uh, you want to move to um... – Doing good, Carlos. We're glad you're here. We Coop, I think, I think that's a good point. I think we move to uh, Torx. Yeah, let's go. We'll see how – ask them if that's what they want to see. They don't, you know. I know Coop said he wants the more experienced person to use the Ryobi. We that's did that. What... He's saying the whole time. Pretty much, yeah. About to go uh, thermal protection, Ryobi. Yo, well, you want to take a temperature? Milwaukee can, is can, the best. We can do that. Or Swiss. I'll help. That's a good idea. Let's take a temperature, gang. So here's our Milwaukee M12 temp gun. If you haven't seen the video where we unboxed the gun, what are some features? That video will be around here. Post-production. Maybe over here, over here. But let's see what the temperature looks like. Let's go Ryobi first. So if we just shoot. We could do that. It's 86 degrees. We go further where, down. Where are you checking the gun at? Right in the middle. Right in the Ryobi sign. 83, 84. Gear? Yeah, right. Check in the gear case. Gear case. Okay, and then check at the rear at the motor house. Gear case is 81. The rear is... 88, 88 degrees. It's hotter at the rear. The Milwaukee on the gear case is 80 degrees. And in the middle, by the gear case, it's 90 degrees, 92, 92 degrees. The battery on the Milwaukee is, let's see, 79.5. And the Ryobi battery is 80 79.5, same same degree on the batteries. Can we the Walt screen? Yeah, when yeah. they're out. We're waiting for them. We're waiting for them. What, what, what does everybody think? Do they want to see want me using the Ryobi? I, I'll assume that that's the truth. Kevin Smith, you're nuts. Yes. Yes. All right. On a count of three and a go. What kind of screws? Spacks? Spacks. These are three inch. I got to tell you, I like the sleeve portion. I, I don't necessarily like the way the bits fit the fastener. In yeah, this they want to see you using the Ryobi. Tokyo Drew is here. What's Konnichiwa. up, Tokyo Drew? Konnichiwa. Your real estate whisperer is here. Well, hello, Rue. The Rue crew in the house. I'm not, I'm not, I'm just saying, I do not love the fitment of, of the bit itself into the fastener. With or without James, we're going to do a one, two, three, and a go. See all that wobble? I'm ready to go when you are. What's up, Phantom Zero? Yo, the real. One, two, three. Go. The Ryobi has Ryobi bits. The Milwaukee has Milwaukee bits. Uh, and the Ryobi takes it. You'll be mounting a comeback. Now, I say we do the same test, five fasteners, with on speed two. Switch guns, though. Why? You're going to keep running the Ryobi? They want to see me run the Ryobi. They're no? saying definitely operator right now. Oh, absolutely. But let's do another test. Yeah, Ryobi's not going to beat the Milwaukee. And, I mean, Electro welder. If the line is frozen, you have to reload it. Yo, it'll be, it'll be, yo, all can decide. What's up, Randall Mason? Listen, I'm not, I'm not trying to be a jerk. Okay, but it's funny if you've if you've not been over to Finish Carpentry TV yet and you're not subscribed, go on over there, check them out. Richard's a real craftsman. He's he's a he's a great guy. They have a great channel over there. Tons of, of how tos and, and you know how tos and what he does as a contractor, a finished carpenter, as a contractor. Who's a finished carpenter? Richard over at Finish Carpentry TV. Yeah. He's now good too. his video the other day, he talked about different tools and different brands, and he talked. It was funny. He got to a point where he said, it's not about 
it's not always about the tool. It's about the craftsman behind the tool. You know, a great craftsman could use anything, Milwaukee, Ryobi, and, and make something great and beautiful out of it, which is a great point. And the other thing is, is that if you take someone that's not experienced, you can give them the best tools in the world. And, and, and what they make is, is still it might be poor. So it's the truth. You're right. Yeah. I mean, you have an average carpenter versus a professional carpenter. The average carpenter. Well, I'm trying to say is, all I was trying to illustrate out of that is the Ryobi might pull it out in this horse race. Just it, saying. It probably will. Pretty cool, Joey from Lansdale. What's up, Joey from Lansdale? Honda 97's here. Cody Gorich, Gorsuch, Dan Soderholm, Bronx, Dan Bur Bronx Burman's here. One, two, three. You know, you can read comments as we're driving. Oh, yeah, I usually do. Okay. Let me know when they're ready. One, two, three. I already called it one, two, three. Go. I kind of forgot. I was What's up, Maverick? Really What's up, Electro Welders? How's it working? I absolutely forgot. The Real Phantom Zero says, fix your angle. RJ Outdoors, what's up? How are you, RJ? How are you, Maverick? I was done. I just drove the last one back. So what do you call that, Ty? What was that? No, nah, Milwaukee won. I just drove that last one down a little bit further. What Milwaukee won? They were, you were done already? Yeah, I was done. There was one that was at flush level. I just pushed it back in. Milwaukee says Dan Soderholm. Call him the tiebreak. Cool. I got to tell you. Going two, it was so much easier because I mean it just. You know what it is. You know what it is. It's because the speed is here, the torque isn't. So what happens is, is that you get that slipping sometimes. All right, what's up next? VCG and Finnish Carpentry collabo? Question mark. Craig Cundiff. We're, we're 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 working on it. We're working on it. You know, it's pretty funny. So we're both. You know, we're both real. We're both real contractors. So this is like the busiest one of the busiest times of the year for us. So for us to get all everything together and do the collab, it's a, it's a little tough. So we're working on it. We just got to get together and make it happen. So at this point, oh, do you want to run? Yo, show them the, the get what we got here. I want to show you guys something real quick. This is the Ryobi kit. Okay. This is what do I have boogers on my neck? No. All right, good. 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 So this is the Ryobi kit. What is this called exactly? What was it called? Drill bits? Yeah, drill bits, right? Drill bit kit? Drill bit, yeah. Right there now. you go. But this is what it looks like. You mean the number? I have to pull it out of the trash. No, it wasn't like a specific name for it. Yeah. Like drill one bits. drive or something. I don't know. Ah. But it comes in a nice, you know, plastic case. Okay, it comes in this clamshell. There you go. Okay. It's called nothing. It's called ideal for standard and impact driving. Oh, there you go. Ryobi, 68 pieces. It was 20 bucks for 68 pieces. So it's it's inexpensive. Um, does it have a product number? It doesn't. So let's get back to the video. Uh, Are we going to lag? Summit's or? laughing. He said it's called nothing. Lag? It really is. So what do we? What's want to next? Do? You I want to, you want to run into? We want to run lags next. Do we want to run paddle bits? We're going to do whole soles with these. Let us know. Get your vote in now because I'm picking the first comment. I want to vote. We ran the fasteners after. The, the standard type screw portion of the test. We have Milwaukee ahead. The, Milwaukee it has four. Roby has two. We're saying lags. Lags is the next up. They're going right, right for the kill zone. All right. Beast from the Middle East, Adam Kazmarek. Beast. They're neither of A these. is waiting patiently for the masonry testing. <laughs> neither of these are from the Middle East. They're more like the middle of uh, the middle of China. What's up, Neil? What's up, Robbie? Ship auger says Neil. We're gonna run the ship auger. Lags, cuff them too. What's up, cuff them? Cuff them. Daniel Terrell, 1977. Lags, Robbie. Lags. Robbie's actually said legs. Legs. <laughs> she got legs. Hello from Argentina, Christian Castilla. What is up, Christian? Castilla. So this is the deal. Argentina. Rob Shipley, what's up, do Rob you, Shipley? Do you want to run Turbo Light OSB? What's up, Turbo Light? Hook them together and run them together. Handy Wyo's here. What happened to the Battle of the Beards? He says. I won. 
<laughs> About time I won something. Listen, in case in case you're, by in, case, in, case you're, in case you're unaware, uh, you know I'm American, right? Born here in the U.S. I'm Native American. I was born here in the U.S. America. Okay, but my my family, we are of Italian descent, so we're big like huggers and kissers. And I go in for the kiss with you know the girls and the women and my aunts and my whoever. And, and I get like the they turn their head because they don't want to kiss my my bearded face. It's I'm true. Like, oh, that's it. I, I, it's too much. I, I like the. That's what broke it. That's what broke. They said you look younger than me now, bro. You I am, definitely look younger than me. Yeah, Listen, baby face. Yo, I'm really I'm really only in my twenties. I actually put <laughs> I I put gray dye in my beard so you think I'm older. All right, let's go. Are we running? Yo, are we running this on two. Or are we running these on one? Or are we just running them however we need to run them to get the fastener set quicker? Because quite frankly, I don't know if, if this will drive these quarter inch faster. We have quarter inch fasteners, right? We have like in, one, one inch and a half, threes, and sixes. So the deal is, is that how, how do we want to run these? Farm boss says two. Run the best speeds, Carlos de la Cruz. So I'm going to start the Ryobi on two. I just am not sure it will be able to drive these lags. We'll find out. Here, pick your poison here. Everybody's saying two. We're going to run them on two. I, I know as we get to the you know the larger fasteners, we're not going to be able to do that. What's up, DR Piper? What's up, Dr. Luke. Dr. Piper? Lou Cypher said you must have been taking class pictures. You ain't going to get James. What's up, James, you, a.k.a. I Rhino? All right. So we're just going to run these. Michael Spiker. And I will run these however I have to. Spicer. Spicer. I'm sorry. I'll go down here. Why are you so close? Edge every day. Are we still in frame? Yes. Yes. One, two, three. Go. Cadwallader. You didn't have to do that, man. We appreciate it. Thank you. Yo. Welcome to the channel, Cadwall. I like the eagle sign. <laughs> Get her built. It wasn't driving it, too. It, sh it literally shut off. Milwaukee. All right. Maverick, go, go, go. So at this point, temperatures? I I'm, feeling some, I'm feeling some heat. The heat, the heat is up. Oh. Feel the, the heat, heat is on. The heat is up. Oh. Fire you up. <laughs> Ready or not. What is it? Turn it in a little bit to your right. So Down. We're, we're hovering right around 93 degrees. 93? 90, 93. Now let's come up here. 85. This is the, the reason, you know, the temperature is lower up here is because... This is plastic, so it's not transmitting the heat out. It's kind of insulating, keeping it in, which is probably not a good a good thing. We come over to the to the mid leg walk. A what's up, Hector Ramos from Puerto yeah. Rico? You can see back here with the motor, we're 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 in and around. Whoa, we're getting to a hundred, right around a hundred degrees. Hundo ninety, uh, and then we get to the gearbox cooler. Okay, we're around ninety ish. This is literally. Okay. The heat is up. You, you got it, you know. So you see what, we'll see what we got there. The okay. heat is on. It's only going to get tougher for the Ryobi and the Milwaukee from here on out. What's up, Mike's Random Vids? We're getting there, Mike's Random Vids. Electro Welder. Very that, true, Kevin. What's that? Mean? Oh, I have to get that. I'm sorry. Okay. Nick. Yeah. Get the socket under. No, nah, stay, stay, stay in frame. He's, he's, he's there. You know where the... Uh... Here you go. What am I looking for? There we go. Yeah. Yeah, you, sir. All right. Oh. Let's see what we got. Can I start now? On the count of three, Junior Salas, LOL, I just watched the collab with the Whisperer, and it's F oh, it hilarious. Okay. Yo, if you guys haven't seen your Real yeah. Estate Whisperer's channel, she does great real estate videos. A lot of information. Very funny. Hysterical characters. 
her and her daughter Sydney and Audrey. Aubrey. Audrey. Audrey. Who's Aubrey? Aubrey. Aubrey. Who's Aubrey? I don't know. You're confusing. I'm me. confusing everybody. Yeah. But go and check out your Real Estate Whisperer. Who's Aubrey? And Eddie Smallhorn as well. But very cool channel. Um, one or two. I'm gonna start in two. I don't know if it will it will make it. Okay. But we'll see. All right, Electro Welder, we'll see you soon. Later, Electro. Glad you were here. On a count of three. One, two, three. Go. Glad you were here, Stuart Byron. Have a good day. Richard Garner, I like to drink alien green blood every day. Every day. Struggling. We're all speed one. Nothing. They just don't want to do it. Not going to do it. What, what's your battery it? level? Wouldn't be prudent. I'm full. Can that be? Is it dead already? Can it be dead already? It's impossible. No, it's full. It's full. Oh. <laughs> How come it didn't light it's up while crazy. It's on, the, on the tool, though? I don't know. Oh, is there, is there another indicator on the tool? There oh, okay. No, it looked like the battery wasn't lighting up. I agree. Yeah. On the it will not go. Sure. It's all right. We don't have to sink it. It's a no-go. All right, give us the next. Come on. All right. We're going to size that, up. Put that light through. Yeah, you cheated. Eighty-three, ninety. You cheated. Ninety-five, hundred and one. Ninety-eight. You got my shoulder. Now I'm taking Jimmy's temperature. Oh no, six. I'm seeing over. This is this is the deal. Yeah. The Ryobi is doing a good job of not destroying itself, and it's whatever technology. It, it's you know this is not necessarily the correct tool, and these fasteners are hot. This is not the, you know might not be the correct tool. You might need to go to like that Ryobi uh, impact driver. That's what Richard Garner just said. Oh yeah, Richard. Your three speed. Oh yeah, speed. Richard. Yeah, Richard. Do me a favor. Can we have the fasteners? <laughs> Do we have? Does they have an impact wrench? They have an impact driver. They have eighty plus tools. From, I know they have a decent from their awesome. from their we from need, their eighteen volt. We need the bigger sockets. Can we yeah. can we have we have those bigger sockets? Can I have the, the little? There we go. Thank you. I know no, this this is correct. Thank you. All right. Something tells me this is not going to happen. Cryobi has a twenty volt glue gun for what? It's, it's not short it's district. Going to do only going to do one thing. Yeah. Nothing. I, I might be able to spin this with my hand quicker. I'm gonna have to get a socket set out. Good. Hold on. Some 18. That's crazy. All right, on the count of three and a go. Very cool, gang. One, two, three. Go. <laughs> You're splitting your wood. I know. I want to go down here. Nothing. You can do it. I'm not going to drive this last one. No. No. It's not gonna work. It's not. He can't even get. I mean. Can you finish it with the Milwaukee? Yeah. 
I'm sure it will. I mean, I have a, this fastener. You're saying? Yeah. You're saying you want him to start this fastener? I mean, clearly the, the Milwaukee one. Yeah, it won already. It's hard for me to top it. So, I mean, it will, but I'm going to have to keep. Yeah. Starting over. Sense to beat the drill. So number number one, this is like we don't even get take the temperature. We don't even get an opportunity to like see these go up in flames. Like the, these two tools are so well protected that they like they somebody's. they will not smoke. They won't overheat. Ninety five. And, you know, I don't want to say it's a shame. That's good for the consumer. It's not necessarily so great for the show here. Move that Milwaukee in a little more. What Milwaukee? There you go. This one? Yeah. The Milwaukee is on the gear case on the rear. 101. 100. It's not even. It 104. 108. You better watch this, Richard Garner says Honda 97. So this is the deal. Where's Redman tonight? I don't see him. He doesn't, doesn't like, like he doesn't he doesn't like Milwaukee. And I know he probably hates Ryobi. So he's a big DeWalt fan and Festool. MFL. He will he will show up the, the night we do Gen 3 against 996. I will say that. I know that much. Who's so 996. DeWalt. Yes. You should probably have him run the DeWalt to make him come and run the DeWalt. Yeah, that would be great. Yo, think about it. That would be that would be. I cool. would come to watch because he's another professional contractor right. with his favorite tool. That would be I versus would, you with your favorite tool. That would be definitely. I, yo, I, if, I, I, if you're out there, Red Man, you're listening. You you just been proposed. Yes. I mean, I think you should stand it because here's the thing: it wouldn't be a true competition to put two people on different skill levels on the tools because you're never going to get a real reading on that. Yeah, but people love it. A bloodbath. I mean, so this is the deal. Thanks. What are we running now? Paddle bits. Uh, you steel. What What do you want to see? What's next? I need a vote. Steel paddle bits. I don't think that right would be going for steel. Why not? Excellent. What's up, Jorge Polaris? What's up, Jorge? We need. We need. We need. I'm waiting for a vote. Okay. Whole saw says Michael Spiker. Whole saw. Whole saw. Another whole saw. Yo, who, who's Two whole saw. Who's here in the uh, in the in the blue wrench brigade? Carlos de la Cruz. Carlos de la Cruz. Jonathan M. Whole saw. Whole saw. Carlos de la Cruz. Yes. What's up, Carlos? Coop was here. Carlos, thanks for holding it down, cause you're the only blue wrench here. We got one. Saying. We got one over here too. Don't worry. You couldn't give it a normal size blue wrench. That is a normal size. Well, I'm a blue wrench, and I'm here in person. And I'm moderating in person. I mean, seriously, I can take this out and take out half a can. With this. So keep it clean. That includes you, James. I didn't say anything. I know. Not, I didn't, not I know. this week. <laughs> I know about you. Coop is here and Jonathan, says Carlos. Okay. So the mod squad. So they want to see whole souls. Full effect. Now, my question is, do we just go straight for this monstrosity of a whole soul? Six? Look at this. The six inch hole saw. Wow. I wonder it went in so easy. <laughs> you running your tool? Yeah. Okay, come over here. No, I'm here, but okay. Are you going to do it for? Okay, come here. Let me set the hole saw. I got it. What wow, says use? Michael. What are you talking about? The size of the hole saw? It's impressive, isn't it? It's a big hole. Yeah. Jonathan is busy looking for deals, though, says Neil. He's the deal what do you want to whisperer. Run on? What do we, what do we, I can't remember what we ran on last week. Got to be one, right? Yeah. It's up to you. Yeah, one. Nick, what Ryobi drill is that? Is that the weak one or the three-speed? No. It's a hammer drill. It's a hammer drill. Brushless cordless 18-volt hammer drill. Hammer. Carlos, Carlos. This is, this, is, this is their biggest offering at the depot in store. Yeah. Okay, I got it. I got it. Timer. Oh, I'll get it. We're gonna get it. I got it here. You got a timer? Yeah, I really didn't want to close this, but I will. We're gonna use my phone. It's okay. Here's a timer. I don't like this. Yeah. Let's stop. Let's stop. 
Yo, what's your fascination with being like over here? Who? You. What do you mean? Like it's a, you, you're just dying to come no, this no, direction. No. You've been working the middle more this week than ever. No. Yes, you have. No. It's you. Look, look at all this room over here versus the room I have over there. You got tons of room. I think yeah, Richard's I think talking about the impact. Yeah, this is a hammer. Here, you come I didn't come here because you was not there. Oh. Because the impact does have three speeds. There's okay. a screw there. You just gotta you gotta go down straight. Cause no cheat. On the count of three to go. One, two, three. Yo, just don't catch your shirt, bro. You're a cheater. Watch your battery Can't too. You start whenever? Your tail. Go. You're, you're not. Stop. Not tighten down enough? No, it's it, off of it. As soon as the pilot went through, it shut down. Michael Spiker, that's a great kit. Where'd you get it at? Here. Cruise. Replay. All right. I think you just go on this one. All right. Tell me when you're ready. I'll count you when down. When I pull the trigger, you hit the button. No, I'll just count the three and you go. Oh, you wait. Where would you do that? All right. Yes. One. That's some more unnecessary steps. One. Two, three. Go ahead, stop, stop. I, I don't know why it's not. As soon as the pilot goes through and the teeth grab, it, it just it jumps off. Yeah. Okay. Could it be the speed setting? No, it's on one. Strange. Let Vince try it. It's not, it's not, it's, it's me. I'm the one setting the, the drill, I, I can't see. Because I had the, the whole soul on there in advance. Okay, you ready? Try it again. All right. All right. All right, now hold on. I can tell you right now, so we're going to do it again. No, it is not. Okay. It should. Okay. One. Hold on then. There it is. One, two. Have them say go. On the count of three and a go, I need to go. One, two, three. Go. You gotta come down. You gotta come down. You gotta. No. You gotta lift it up out of there. I, I get that. All right, start some momentum and come down light. You can't push. Too hard. I want. I'm telling you. Are you on one or two? I'm on one. I'm not even giving it any pressure right now. Here, give it a run. Come on, you got fish. Finish strong. You, you're on this on two by fours. Keep going. Ben Sheps. You're, you're, you're Milwaukee's in the lead. Again. Milwaukee's in the lead. <laughs> we did lags. Yeah. Roby went and do the lags. I, I, it, will, it will cut the hole. You spacks. have to keep going. Hold it up and then give it. I am. As soon as, as, soon as, you, go. as, soon as, as soon as you make contact, it stops. Keep going. Your life depends on this. Keep going. Come on. I was just going to take this out and punch it a little quicker. <laughs> I know. Take it out and start it up and then hit it. I have it. It's, it's off right now. And as soon as I touch, it stops. Keep going. Put it in two. It's not going to help. Keep going. Bring it up and just let it get the speed. No. Put it in one. Like the pedal. Crooked. You're in crooked. You gotta bring your front. 
Inhale, up. Big. Up. Beautiful. Beautiful. Two minutes, 21 seconds. <laughs> oh, my God. Two minutes, 21.90 seconds. Slow death. <laughs> you ain't kidding me. It's the clutch, says Robbie. It's, there's, it's not the clutch. is not engaged. It should be. It is engaged. But he had the clutch engaged. Because he, he somehow slipped it into uh, 14. Because the selector ring is an all-in-one now. Yeah, on the Gen 3 it is. How is that possible? I Good ring. call. Evan Horde, Robbie. Well, I should have touched this left right. No, Evan Horde. I didn't want to because I was using the handle. Plus Jonathan M. That's weird. We have a bunch of them over here. We'll ship them out to you for free. Cody Gorsuch, thank God that was the issue. Signed. We'll say this. New hole says somebody me too. Coops. I was bumming out. It's pretty out. funny. Yo, I was bumming out. Were you time. worried? I was because I didn't know what, what was going on. As soon as you would make contact, it would stop. Yeah, right, let's no, go. Strange. Are you running this or am I? No, you, no, you can run it. Let's Come go. on. Get in there, James. Sure. Redeem yourself. You know, I had. I... Finish Carpentry TV. Did you try the Ryobi yet? No, no, not, no. Not, not, not with the six inch <laughs> hole saw. We, we have. Ran the Ryobi and other tests, but not with the six-inch hole saw. Ready? On the, yo, we need to go on the count of three. One, two, three. Go. Now it's jumping off. A little different that <laughs> Ten yeah, seconds. Send me the six and one. Yo, I'll blow it up and make yo, it a hole. That was literally impressive. Ten seconds. That was literally, yo. That compared to last week's contestants, think about that. Yeah, that's true. Well, last week, last week the best was eight seconds, and that easily would have been eight if I didn't jump off the first. Oh, uh, it would have probably been less. That thing is a beast. As soon as the teeth, that time, as soon as the teeth caught the plywood, it was literally trying to rip me off of it. That much power, huh? Oh, yeah. Ryobi won't touch it, Michael Spiker. Yeah, that thing was a beast, huh, James? Yeah, look, I mean, I barely even gave it enough throttle. And look how much of the 2 by 4 it took out. Look. Wow. It blew through that and went through this all the way down. I'd say it's a good inch and a half. 98 stands here. He says, Gen 3 naysayers eat crow. Yo, I got to tell you. I think after that, you need to take a 10, right? Yeah. I don't know what you guys are doing here, but whatever. Yo, I, I, listen, everybody. I got it under control for you. 95 down by the battery, 100. Hundo. Go back to the back of it, closer to the back. There you go. 100, 101, 103. Oh, whoa. 112. 110. Now they were up to 180 a couple weeks ago. So now the Ryobi. 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 Brobra. Robla. Ryobla. Yeah. Yeah. Same. I missed the first hole being done with a clutch. Yo, Matthew says, yes, Vince, Vince got his hair cut. Look good. Yo, thank you, Matthew. I appreciate it. Dr. Piper says, hey, 94. William Davis got a slight fever. I'm sorry to hear that. So. I want to see this real. The tool, Vince. William Davis. Who said Kristen, I'm, Kristen, who said I'm a tool? I don't think he said that. Okay. No, I think he meant it in figurative terms. All right. Yeah. Yeah. I think this will do it. All right, on the count of three, go. are you timing this, James? Yeah. Hold on. Just make sure I'm not break through. Jonathan M., the Ryobi is about to go up and smoke. This is the exact same situation that killed my Ryobi. Yo, I got to tell you, this, I don't think it will go up in anything. I don't think it's going to go. Because I think the technology will shut it off. 
But maybe I'm wrong. Quite frankly, I wouldn't mind a little smoke. Smoke. I wouldn't mind a little smoke. Carlos says straight. he's got 10 seconds flat on it. I am straight. No, your front's way too far. The wood's crooked. Oh, okay. <laughs> One, two, three. Go. Oh, God forbid. What's the problem here? It's not over. It's not over. One. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. You're not hitting any screws, right? I don't know. I just think it happened to me. Yeah, I think you're good. The reality is that you don't want to go in too hard, right? That's but then you, when you don't, then it, it, it bounces yeah, you out. Yeah, that's exactly what happened to me. Right. You don't want to put too much pressure to you up to speed, and then you hit it and it jumps you. Well, you just need more weight, I guess, on it. One, two, three. Go. It was like it was. It stopped at nine, but it didn't start right away. You were closer to eleven, but it wasn't bad. You know, eleven I, seconds. I can tell you, not bad, in my opinion. Number one. Number two. It's funny, even though it's on drill setting, I was getting some slipping. It's odd. It's like, what do you do? So let's take some temps. Finished Carpenter TV says, wow, Ryobi made it through. I can't believe it's Cadwalder, spun this. Not yeah. bad. So my question is, so we're only at 91, cool. 90 degrees. This gun is very insulated, though, with plastic. 90.3. Battery is at 83. Holy smokes, that alien is a beast, high to 97. Yeah, we're at 90, 90 degrees. I don't know that I would call it a beast. So I'm so, surprised it went through. So this is the question. Like, So we have a clear winner on that one? Yeah, Milwaukee. Milwaukee won, but I feel like we need a do-over? Possibly, yeah. You want to, you run both of them this time. Yeah. So we get a better judge. Ow. Now I got splurred. Yeah, that's what you get for making fun of me earlier. Cad Wilder, I will agree. That's definitely it's definitely for the homeowner. No, it's not doing bad though. No, it's good. I mean, no Working doubt about really it. Somebody can make a living with this. Green China is almost as good as red China. Who said that? Fusion 2016. <laughs> Milwaukee was like two minutes though. LOL. Yeah. It was. That was the first time. The first Milwaukee test it was. Vince set me up. He did it on purpose. Michael Spiker. Yo, the OnePlus platform is huge, and it's very good. Who said that? Who said uh, Ryobi has a good platform? Who said that? I got a huge platform. Who? Michael Spiker. Spiker. All right. I, I will say this immediately. You have more control with a handle here, a larger handle. I'm ready when everybody else is. One, two, three. Go. All right, all right. Seven point eight seconds. But it worked. <laughs> we got a lot of wood to load. I want to see something. Kristen Castillo says Uno dos Trace. Quattro Cinco Six. No, I thought I thought my pilot I thought my pilot bit might be loose in here, but it's not. But we got through there pretty quick. I felt I feel like if it didn't if it wasn't bouncing, we wouldn't have this problem. Let me 
I'm saying the same thing. There's no integrity left in that plywood, so it's moving on. Well, I just want to get kind of bumming out about it, but I think uh, do, you, do you have to even run? Richard Garner says, my my, wa my walkie rep told me that a lot of contractors are buying Ryobi tools over the wall and raging. Yeah, okay, Richard. Richard Garner, for real? Is there a reason for that? I think what Ryobi has a battery-powered edger and needs a lot of juice, not to mention some of their other tools. Like, Ryobi makes everything. They even make disco balls that go in your... Is that real? Yeah. They may, I think it's a radio and a disco ball that goes in your pool. That's actually a good idea. It's pretty cool. I, Campbell, I that is that. true. So, so do they want me to run it again with the Ryobi? I will. Sticker slash circle kit. Dan Soderholm. Toolman Mellow's here. Yo, Toolman. I need an answer. What's up, Mellow? I need an answer. I didn't hear the questions. Do they want to run the Ryobi? One more time. Yeah, yeah. I've seen a Ryobi riding lawnmower at my Home Depot. LOL, says finished carpentry. Does it work with an 18 volt battery? <laughs> no, huh. it's a 40 volt platform, I believe. Yeah, yeah. I just found a hunk of wood in my beard. Wow. Flavor saver. Justin. Campbell, they also make a cool pool vac. They do, Richard. They make everything, literally everything, even riding lawnmowers, apparently. All right, on the count of three. Oh, and a go. And a go. It's not a 40 volt. Jonathan M. What is it, Jonathan M? Where do I not see it? DIY nurse. Hey, guys, got a great deal at Lowe's five minutes ago because of you guys. Thank you. Awesome, DIY nurse. What'd you buy? What'd you get? Ryobi's not bad, but I'm going to stay loyal to my brand, Milwaukee. I wanted, I wanted to secure this, but... There's probably a nugget in your beard, too. <laughs> it's horrible. It might be. Like right. Chicken nuggets? I, yeah, I used to have chicken nuggets in my beard. All right, I'll count of three to go. No more playing around. One, two, three. Go. Fourteen point nine three. You could all see, it's set on drill, not driver, and it's still, for some reason, clutch was kicking in. DIY nurse Vaughn twenty two ounce framing hammer seven twenty eight. Nice. DIY nurse. Yo, I'm gonna go over there. Wait, what? What you? Get? A, a framing, framing hammer, framing for eight hammer. bucks. Yeah, that's not bad at all. No, not bad. That's a, that's a thirty dollar hammer. What kind of what brand was it? Vaughn. Oh yeah. Good deal. I had a Vaughn hammer once. I left it here. Now it's lost. You can leave it here. Minnesota, come oh, on out, says DIY nurse. It, sure left here. it didn't let Richard down. No. I don't know. We're always getting blamed for everything. All right, somebody get in frame. I All need right. to move out a frame. Where are the beers? Hector Ramos, the cerveza. The beards or the beers? The, the beers. I don't drink. No? No. And if I do, it's... Not beer. Where so, are the beers? Who's I'm the a winner? professional man. <laughs> Coop, you're nuts. Who is the winner? I would say Milwaukee. Yeah, Clearly true. Milwaukee. Ryobi is shocking. I'm pretty happy about that. Shocking. I'm going to go home and show my kid this. Probably like, you see what I did? I won one. <laughs> this, is pretty, this is not bad. All right, so what do we have next? What do we want to see next? What is next, very cool gang? We need a vote. We have metal. We have metal. We have, we have paddle bits. We have ship auger bit. We have one inch concrete bit, masonry bit. We need to know. Edge every day says metal. Cinder block drop test. Metal. Cinder block drop test. I'm in. <laughs> I got. I got two metals, concrete, and a one and a half inch paddle. District guy. I think I think the largest we have is inch and a quarter paddle. So whatever, give me give me a yay or a nay on something, Nick. Uh, let's go paddles first. Okay. We're going paddles. 
Grab your, grab your weapon. Cool up. So I want to see what, what did John say? 6.0, they have new tech. You gotta get through the wood first. Paddle into concrete, Cody Gorsuch. Paddle, paddle into concrete? <laughs> yeah. You'd be up the creek without a paddle if you did that, Cody. Yeah, you wouldn't have the paddle left on the pit. Yeah. Concrete for the kill, says Carlos. Concrete will kill. Yes, it would probably be the end of all. What are you doing? I'm trying to flick it like right into the eye of the of the beholder. Yeah. Richard Garner, have you brought up the issue of the wrong batteries? Jonathan M. So Jonathan M made a case that he says the Ryobi has a six amp hour battery that improves the tool apparently. Really? This is what came with the kit. Yeah, we're running what we got. We run what we wrong. Yeah, so I don't know if it's not improving this one, but it's still a four amp hour battery. Let's see, it's better than a, a smaller battery. And quite frankly, it's still got four four bars. I mean, in any well, way, I have to check the batteries out to see if that that's actually the case. What happened? The hat. We'll have to check. I'll I'll check the batteries out to see if the six actually improves the performance. I think maybe it might. All right, you guys ready? Let's go. One, two. You want one or two? I'm on one. There's no way this is going to stand. The 97 says, two. show us some concrete evidence. <laughs> one. Those are Bosch paddle bits. No, yes. you have a Bosch you have, oh, Okay. Well, I didn't know if you had a, uh, what's a, a, a handle on it. So you're going to need it. Yo, so, check this out. Jonathan M. just called his daughter Carlos. Her name is Carmela, but Nick said Carlos right as I was saying her name, and it just came out. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's horrible. Give me a favor. There's a knot there. It's like, I hope you uh, apologize, you Jonathan. Your, your elbow's going to hit me in the hand. Or, or move, move. You can move further. I'm right here. Did she answer you with an Ola? All right. One, two, three. Go. I mean, these are two brand new blades. Literally, just pull both these out of package. I think Ryobi was close. I'm no not. go? Huh? Is that a no go? Definitely a no go. That's a no go zone. I mean, was I not putting enough weight on it? I mean, maybe I'm just too short. You want to try it again? Not really. You can try it again if you want. Run it on two, Vince. You want to switch tools? Are you on two? No, it's on one. Vincent is in two. reverse. You so switch tools? No, I wasn't. Try it on speed two, says Neil. Okay, so I feel it can make any difference. I'm a little taller. Maybe I get some more leverage in the Ryobi. I get the advantage of a step ladder. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Let's try it again. All right. Count of three and a go. One, two, three. So Go. Big. I thought I was going to lose that one too, but I got a weak spark. You almost, you almost took you out. You guys? I almost took you out. It's, it's literally not enough speed. Yeah! Winner. No, they're brand new blades, Honda. They're both brand new blades, literally brand new blades. Okay. All right. I think it's time to put that in hammer drill mode and move to the concrete. Who said that? That's what we want. They want to see. Concrete or or ship order bit.
Concrete or ship auger? Because once you go into concrete, it's going to be... There's no coming back. Yet. There, yeah, that's it. literally no coming back. Michael Spike. Ah, uh, they're all saying concrete. Concrete. Let's do the ship auger. You want to do the ship auger first? Kevin Smith says auger. Look at the size of that auger. We could run the ship auger bit first into the pressure treated two by sixes. Okay. If we do the one inch masonry bit, both of these tools are going to be extremely hot. And quite frankly, the Ryobi battery could probably be dead. So, and we only have one. So I would probably run the ship auger first, but we'll do whatever the very cool gang wants. Here, you're running both of these. Why? I'll time you. Somebody's going to have to hold. I'll hold, I'll hold the other end and time you at the same time. Unless you want to do metal. I'm getting some votes for metal as well. If you want to run metal, we'll, we'll run metal. I, I just need to know what you want to run. So whatever they're saying they like to run, I'm I'm fine with. I I'm seeing I'm seeing more metal. More metal than chip auger right now. Give us some heavy metal, says bull nuts. Alright. You go. I gotta go back to work now. Thanks, guys. <laughs> go metal, metal, metal. You have a WD forty or I solves all that Ryobi hand for the next test. I put it in the back. Apprentice. Let me ask you, give me that give me that for one second, please. Just check, just, just check. Half inch? Is it? Okay. Yeah. I get it. Or you can do it. Again. One battery, Jonathan. Yes. Came with a four amp hour battery. One single four. One battery? Yes. One single four amp battery. Yes. Yes. I want to move the metal closer together. Nick, they have a deal right now where you, you get a free 4.0 with this drill kit. You got, Yeah, but that was online, Jonathan, I believe. You'd have to order it and then wait. And we were trying to do that. Yeah, confirm that with Jonathan because if, if that's true and it's in store, I'm going back to get my battery. Yeah, that's true. Is it in store, Jonathan? I'm waiting for you, Jonathan. In store, yeah, says Carlos. Go how much was it? How much was it? How much was it, Jonathan? How much was it, Carlos? We paid. Two. I paid. I paid one. I paid one nineteen for this kit. On a count of three and a go. One, two, three. You're on one. Mm -hmm. Go.
Just play my face. A game is here. Why is he blood? What's up, demon? That's it. Now they walk in. Me with the right, what are you doing? Okay. It's quarter inch, right? Half inch, half inch. Half inch. Half inch. Take it, take it over here. Uh, remember, the laser doesn't hit the actual. When you're that close, the laser yeah. doesn't hit. Oh. You got 91.2 there. And 130 on the back. Here you got... 97 on the back, 88 on the gear case. This thing's running way cooler. The Ryobi. 86. The alien technology. Yeah, it, yeah. I mean, the Milwaukee won, but it's just a little bit higher. If it ain't yellow, it deader. <laughs> <laughs> it's Carlos de la Cruz. Listen, Carlos, I have a yellow and it's dead. Yo, link the video where it smoked, James. Somewhere over there. You're, what happened? No, it's not. The video is over here. It's where it is. That's where it's at? It's where it's going to be. So I was running my impact driver, brand new one that I just bought, against a Milwaukee Gen 3. No, oh, Gen 2. It was Gen 2? That's how bad that the walk sucks. That's how bad that the walk sucks. Gen 2 beat that the walk. He didn't mean that the walk guys. He didn't mean that. Um, Listen, there's a lot of the wall tools that I love. But yeah, link the video where the DeWalt SDS over here smoked the Milwaukee SDS. It will be there. <laughs> Let's see. Edge, I might have to start calling you eggs every day. Hashtag eggs every day. Richard Garner. Describe in, in Espanol and Spanish. Tambian demon. Are you doing the uh, the ship auger bit or are you Explain going to the in Spanish? I think we gotta go right to I think we should do ship auger first. Ship auger. Yeah, ship auger. Here you go. Yo, my brother said your beard is nice. Alexander. So, ship auger. Alexander said your beard's nice. 
You're going to time this? Yeah, I'll time. And then depth. Yes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start this out on two and, and see how far I can get. Nick, you have a tape in the bag? There might be one in there. So what I'll do is I'm gonna start I'm gonna start the drill on number two because the faster speeds help expel the shavings of of wood out of the hole and allows it to move forward. The problem is as as you get as you get deeper into the hole, there's more friction on the drill bit, and then the it will then slow down. It won't be enough torque to spin in number two. So then I might need to switch over to number one. The higher torque setting to keep it moving. Per K, Christian. Per K. Okay. How much battery? So, how much battery levels left before we start? So, so I'm Mr. literally. Mr. wants to know. I'm. I got. I got three on the. Yo, you both don't need to read comments. Do you have a? Do you have a tape measure yet? Do you want me to go get the tape measure? Right no, I'll get it. I'll go get it. I'm in a building. No, no. Tape measures go missing. They always go missing. We should hide them from one day. All the tape measures? Yeah, just hide them all. Like, hey, all the pencils, the all the pens. <laughs> Tell us what we should hide around here that you can't find. Let's see him get really easy before he gets back. Somebody what if we misplaced the real week? No, I can't do that. It's too big. It's too obvious. Yeah, we'll find something else. Grab his cat. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's horrible. No, seriously. Give us something to... Are you going to time this? Yeah, absolutely. All right. Can't wait. All right, so what are you going to do here? Yo, El Cid. What's up, El Cid? And hold this end. You're going to drill that thing through, and uh, you're going to tell me when to stop. <laughs> no, it's Furious Friday. It's Furious Friday. Oh, Furious Friday. <laughs> it's Furious Friday. All right, Ryobi, ship auger bit. Part one. Test one. Act one. One, two, three. Good. It's so pretty than I thought it was. Has this number dried out all over? Probably, yeah. That's it. Boom. 34 seconds. Wow. Yo. It's almost, almost done. Like, wow. it won't even turn on. Like, because if you remember, the battery might be dead. There might not be a what's it called. Doing good, says District Guy. It's not bad. Let's get a measurement. So there's four and a half inches. Still left a bit. Four and a half inches, Matthew L. Walton. What's up, Matthew L. Walton? You think it'll come out? Take it off and put the what's the name on it. Spin move. That's a veteran move right there. Whoa. Yay. The veteran move is, is that this, this drill's bad. You want to get a temperature while it's hanging here? Because quite frankly, it's it's it's. Can I have the temperature gun? Thank you. Okay, so it's it's up to. It's up to ninety, eh, 95, 96 degrees here at the gear case. Okay, back at the rear, it's at about one hundred and ten, one hundred and thirteen. Now, somebody should take the battery out and put it back in. I was actually thinking that too. Battery's at about 88 degrees. Loosen the chuck and use the Milwaukee to take it out. EJM Demon. Yeah, I'll try it. Yeah. Maybe. Oh, snap. It's like a reset. reset it. Yeah. It's ridiculous. That's what happened the first time with the, the reading, right? Remember? Okay. So, how many inches do we have left? Four and a half. Four and a half inches. Ooh, got you it. got it, dude. Did I? Have, did that look pretty cool, at least? What was that? 
Husqvarna rider, don't lose power. Keep your batteries charged. Matter of fact, now that he's saying that, let me just test this real quick. It's still got three batteries, three bars. It should be fine for this. For the, yeah. Yeah. Finale. The finale. All right. So now, 34 seconds with nine, with four, four and a half, half inches. inches. Well, we know the Milwaukee's going to drive it. 30, I mean, 34 seconds. And, and four and a half and inches. Four and a half inches. And this is going to bury it. And I'm saying it's going to bury it. All right. And I'm saying this is going to bury it. 20, 20, 20 seconds. seconds. Something like that. Now, should we take a pre? This is what I like to do. Let's get a pre test temperature. So on the handle, we're at 98, 99 degrees. On the gear case itself, we're right about 100 degrees. And back at the, the rear of the motor, about 100. And, you know, we're in a, we're in a little further here. We're right around 110 degrees. Okay? We could do smaller concrete bits if you want. All right. Milwaukee ship auger bit. Take one. Test one. One, two, three. Whoa, wait a minute. I'm going to start the countdown. One, two, three. Go. I hit a bolt. I hit a bolt. I hit metal. I knew I was going to hit metal. Ooh, what's up, Philip? Do over, Michael Spiker. Spicher. Do hit over. It, hit it from this side, Vince. That's not a bad idea. No, I'm going to hit it over here. Okay. Take two. Really Take two. Things. Test two. One, two, three. Four. Go. Yeah, it's, either you moved off of it or or that that just ruined the bed. That probably ruined the bed because I don't move. Dude. Yeah, it chipped the bed. It chipped the bed. We can try it one more time. Yeah, no way. It's not going through anymore. Done. Clearly, you can see Milwaukee was on a way to win. There goes a $60 ship over bit hitting metal. Stinks! Another casualty of tool wars. Literally. I wonder if I could file this down. And sharpen this and sharpen this bit. Dan Soderholm, get the drill doctor. <clears throat> will, will this work on the drill doctor? Will drill, drill doctor won't sharpen this, will it? See it? Here? Yeah. File it, Junior South. See it? Yeah. I'm going to have to file it. I'm going to file it away as a waste of 60 bucks. It's not a waste. You died a hero on Tool Wars. Yeah. Went down in a, in a blaze of fury. Glory. Glory, oh, fury. fury. You don't want to go down in a blaze of fury. <laughs> <laughs> that wouldn't Flat be. bastard. Flat bastard. bastard, yes. Flat bastard file. All right, hold on, man. Yo, entertain, entertain everybody. Do something like kind of show to Bastard filed I, 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 in I, I, diamond sharpness. I don't know what we're doing out of here while you're back there. Did you guys think something like your hybrid? They said um, big knives... Nice. Where's the chip? Right up in there. Right on the edge there and on the edge here. You can actually feel it. It's real smooth. It must be grinding right that metal. 
Man. The Milwaukee was going to win, though. I will say that. Oh, yeah. The Milwaukee was definitely going to win. But that's the kind of test, especially with that type of extreme test. You can't, I, I, was, I was shocked that the Ryan made it as far as it did. Matthew, Matthew L. Walton, fourteen ninety nine Cannoli money for new bits. Thank you, Matthew L. Walton. We really appreciate it, man. Yo. You didn't have to do that. That was awesome, bro. Thank you so much. I really would like to run this test. These tool tests can get expensive. Five pesos. Thank you, Fusion 2016. You didn't have to send any money, man. We appreciate it. The auger bit deserves a spot on the wall of honor. And should we hang it up like, right here? We should hang it up in the back. Like, put a we'll have like an in memoriam yeah. for the auger bit. Stephen Lanham, 999. Get some bits. Right Thank you, buddy. Vince is giving it CPR. He's not letting it go. No, because I want to see this work. Thanks, Stephen Lanham. Mary Jo, so nice, guys. Yo, that's what it is. The Very Cool Gang pulls together. They support the channel. They support one another. That's why it's the best community on YouTube. Right, James? Absolutely. Absolutely. All right, I got something for you guys. Where's that 12 battery? You see it? It's on the impact right behind it. No, it's not. It's over in the lights. It's not. Come up with anything yet? What's that? Did they come up with anything for my uh, channel? The, yet? the knives. Yeah. The knives, yeah. Okay. Problem is, they're kind of hard to get to, guys. <laughs> secondary contest we're running. There's the new Milwaukee HD high output 12.0 battery. Put take you, do we do the drive the rest of these bolts down? On the impact wrench. Yeah. There you go. We're ready to go. You ready? Whenever you want. That'll do it. Yeah, a little bit. It's pretty impressive that, especially that it, it, it started from a, from a yeah. dead stop. Yeah. 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 Now, now, whether this is sharpened enough. Take three. Or even correctly. One, two, three. I need to go, very cool gang. Go. Thirty-seven point three two. There's only one problem. I, I cleaned it out once. You probably should have. It would have. It would have shortened the time. Would have shortened. The time. It would have got it done quicker. If I probably could. about thirty-one seconds. No, what I'm no, saying. No, you wouldn't have been able to get through. I wouldn't have been able to get through. Oh, okay. because if you look, this is this 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 is still wet compared to that. Yeah, it's a lot easier to dry hardened wood than it is softer. Wet wood, but this is not good. <laughs> it's flat. No, oh, it's going well. Yeah. 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 I don't know what that is.
Pen Chef says, Vince, you're the best meatball surgeon on YouTube. Thank you. Mass meatball reference. Meatball surgeon? Is that a backhanded compliment or is that? No, it's a mash reference. Where, where do we mash. go here? Mash. Yeah. I used to watch mash. I was in this hole. So if I go here, I should be okay. okay. Let's try it again here. Let me see what I got battery wise. District. Hey, great demo on how to sharpen a 60 bit in the field. Get the job done. Way to go. Pat on the back. District I. I'm not licking this battery. On to the next. Here, right? Is that is that a one key 5.0? I, I don't like these one key 5.0s. I think it this is. is a one key 5.0. I don't like the one keys. We have a, a 5.0 that's not one key. No, unbelievable. Here, the old 4.0. Give me that 4.0. I'd rather have the I'd rather have the 4.0 at this point. Wanna know why? Because the one cage, it was flashing. It was flashing. Can't break China stuff. It's nuts. One, two, three. I need to go. Oh, wait a minute. All right, go. In 25 seconds. So this was four inches out and it took 10 seconds less. Boom. Winner. Gen 3 over the Ryobi. The Ryobi is, yeah. is, it, Ryobi's impressed me though so far. I can tell you. It's extremely, extremely. I expected a lot less. So battery. Battery's right around 80 degrees, 81 degrees. The handle is now at 110. The motor's at 130 and change, 135. And the gear case, if we get a little closer, if we go right to the gear case, gear case. Well, that's, that's weird. See, let's come on this side. It's at one, it's like 113. The heat, the, the handle itself, Rolling that heat out. I like that. He hit the lag on the first one. He had to resharpen the bit. Now, if we were going to properly use the, the auger bit, we would clean out. One clean out, you can see it easily sunk, sunk it, no problem. Woo! Holy moly donut chuck. Tip of the auger temp. Tip of the auger. Yeah, I gotta tell you. <laughs> tip of the auger. Sharp up pretty nice. Top of the morning, tip of the auger. It might not work. And the rest of you. The blade itself is about 110. Pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. I could cook breakfast on the Milwaukee Fusion 2016. You know, this is the thing. It's not keeping, it's it's just, it's getting the heat out of the gun. That's why you're seeing the temperatures. It's getting the heat out of the electronics, out of the motor. It's getting it out of the gun and it, it's being dissipated through, through this heat sink. The gun's not overheating, it's not shutting off, and it's definitely not smoking the frying. So... I don't think there's any heat issues. And, and, and quite frankly, I mean, we haven't ran, we're going to run the hammer drill test, but... I'm not feeling heat in the in the trigger area and all. We're it's about not to, burning up. We're about to, it's definitely not burning up. We're gonna see if that's about to change out. Raider Nation's here. So what else do we have to run? Just the concrete. Yeah, I think it's concrete. Concrete time? Yeah. Alright. I can. I mean, we have other <laughs> HAM demons. Though. We have other, you know, we have other, we have the, uh, the Bosch bits. 
We have the Bosch uh, masonry bits if they want it. The little guys? Well, we'll start with the little guys, right? Or are we going straight for the, for the just, stuff? We know it's, we know it's bad. Raider Nation just watched the one key giveaway video. Did you leave a comment, Raider Nation? Yo, we have either we could run these little bits or we could go for the Gusto and have the final test. It's up to you guys. It's funny, Demon, because I used to do the same thing. Don't use Sometimes that. with firecrackers, it was bad. There's I was a, bad kid. A, uh, what's his name in there? Anchor? Yeah. I'm not going to go to the same hole. Go big or go home. There, I, I agree. I'll time it. All right. Let's do it. Ryobi. Concrete. Test one. One, two, three. On, on a counter, I need to go. Go. Yes, that is Milwaukee vacuum. So it's 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 polishing. Not, not how long was that? Minute forty. All right, so this is the deal. We're gonna see how far the Milwaukee can get into the concrete in a minute and forty seconds. Because I mean, that was only a minute and forty seconds. It seemed much longer than that. Mm -hmm. So, quite frankly, we're gonna see how far it could get. If it could get deeper, I will assume that it's going to. That was just ridiculous and harsh. Just. A waste. I mean, if, if you guys are unsatisfied with that result, what we could do is if you're unsatisfied with that result, what we can do is we can we could use some smaller bits. We're gonna need that. One, two, three. Go. Go. Thank you. 
I say it's pretty obvious. Yeah. <laughs> Who called me out, boy, on this time? Look. Dirty Randy. You looking? Yeah. yeah. Okay. It's a difference. So, I will say this. Uh, very similar to last week's tool, tool, tool war. We'll link it here. In, in this area, the gun got extremely hot. You're starting to see, yeah, the grease. Some some grease leaking out of the gear case, only on the one side. Now whether that's from deflection or pushing down, I I don't know. But let's take some temp readings. Yeah. So at the motor. We're at about 150. 150. At the gear case on the handle, we're about 153, 151. And on the gear case itself, 160 degrees. The battery is running at about 100. An ungloved hand on the tool. I mean, you know, it's going to be uncomfortable. How's it feel? I mean, if you were if you were pressing down and operating, it's it's, hot. it's going to be it's going to be uncomfortable. Yeah, I mean, listen, I just squeezed it, and that screw was making my hands hot. Good question. But think about the bit. I mean, yeah, they sell they sell this drill bit, this masonry drill bit. It's a one inch bit for half inch drills. But the reality is, is that. There are better tools to drill. Right, you'd be using an SDS. Yeah. You're not using no. a hammer drill for a one-inch bit. So, keep that in mind. But it's part of the testing criteria, so that's what we do. And that's how we do it. So, the, the, the winner is, we didn't have, like, the Cinderella story tonight. No, it wasn't, no, it wasn't an upset. It, it, was, it was not. You had... That's what you call a rear end whipping. Yeah. The good part about the Ryobi. Ryobi is, came out of the gate strong now. Speaking of rear end, speaking of rear end whippings, the Ryobi Corporation has thoughtfully put a whole bunch of, of rubber here on the back end. Okay. Can you drop it? Well, to protect it from falls and stuff like off the of ladders. You know, homeowners have a bad habit of dropping their tools. You know what? And, and the tool, the, the homeowners will drop it on the rear end. Boom. So they have the protection. Can I tell you why they have the that rubber. problem? It's unbelievable. Because they stand good them and, up like this. Good and thoughtful. I agree. The homeowners? Yes. Homeowners have a bad tendency of dropping their tools because they're not wearing belts. They're leaving them on top of it. And boom, the homeowners, boom, they drop them on the rear end. It gives it a real pounding. It's no good. In this area, so they, they protect it with rubber. That's why I lay my tools down like that. Yeah, okay. save your tools. I'm homeowners. Don't be a homeowner, okay? You have a lot well, that's the American dream. I'm being sarcastic. So yeah, no. American dream to be a homeowner. Yo, Chris Crockle vlogs. So, is there anything else the very cool gang will like, like us to do with these tools? This evening, besides run them over with a truck or hit them with or hit them with the, the, the hammer. Hit it with a Scottish dirk. Whoa, Richard wants to see us hit it with a Scottish dirk? No, I said that. I think it was a good test. I think Milwaukee triumphs. It does. And, and, and quite frankly, we were just trying to give this is a professional grade tool. Okay, this is made for contractor daily use. I mean, you can run these, you can run this hammer drill in the manner that we've run it. 
save for the one inch masonry bit. Okay. I think every other task, this gun would, would do just fine on a daily basis as a contractor grade tool. When it comes to the Ryobi, it did very good. It held its own. This is a DIYer and homeowner type tool. I think that if you were to try to do these, these tasks with this hammer drill driver on a daily basis, it would quickly need to either go in for service or need to be replaced. I don't, I don't believe this is going to, to stand up to the torture as well as the Milwaukee. I will say this. It is a lot cooler, but it got a lot less work done and shot out a shot out. It's shot out. So shot out. It is shut down a lot quicker. It's just, it's not able to do the job. So. Speaking of shooting, I think one of these Fridays for Tool Wars. Yo, Phil Bordeaux says, go. We should, do like, <laughs> we should make you shoot basketball with me. Something like I could. You will show at me. I'm not, I'm not good at basketball. Kind of cool. Yeah, it's not a Tool war. What if you play basketball with only tools, though? So this is the deal. Can we put shells up there? Who which can put shells up faster? Quite frankly, Eddie, I think that the, the Milwaukee is lighter, okay, more nimble and more powerful. I think that you could probably get the shells up faster with the Milwaukee. And this is big and bulky. The Ryobi is not bad. But I will say this. You could get shells up with either one. You definitely could get shells up with either one. And as a homeowner, if you're if that's your if that's the level of the work that you're going to be doing, is just hanging shelves. Okay, maybe maybe the angle brackets have to go into a masonry wall. You still might need a, a hammer drill for that, right? right. But, but that that'll get it done. This will get it done. This will get it done. I was actually impressed. All, all joking aside, I mean, I know it took a It wasn't really a fair competition, but I was actually pretty impressed with it. So was I, I. I wasn't expecting as much as. Like the whole saw? That was pretty nice. I literally have to, you know, whether the technology filters down from Milwaukee into Ryobi, I'm very impressed that this gun, this drill, hammer drill driver, shut itself down instead of going up in smoke. We have no smoke in here. We have no fire. I got to tell you, I'm a little disappointed. We have no fire, but good old Ryobi for making sure that this technology has has filtered are you, down. Are you going to hit that with that glamorous hammer you got there? Glamour hammer. That's right. That is a, that's a good call. That is a glamour hammer. Look at the sparkle on that head. That's right. No, no, no. It's not a glamour hammer. Look at it's it. It's to crack the bell. So so this is the deal, everybody. Is there anything <laughs> else you'd like to see this this evening, afternoon, these, these go through? Anything that we can do to help you in making your buying decision? We still got the uh, metal studs. You know we do. We do have Philip Bordeaux. When you say metal, what are we? What are we talking about, Philip Bordeaux? We just drilled through a half inch. We drilled, angle we drilled iron. through half inch angle iron. Dave Henning says whole saw. We did the whole saw. Dan, I hear you. Says EJM. With Dan some better tape on your It's easier for me to speak than write. Yo, me too, bro. That's why I make videos. That's why I'm a vlogger and not a blogger. Definitely. District one. I have a need for a tech techo gun. Anybody use the Waltz 20 volt techo gun? Thumbs up or down? Techo gun? Mr. Something Basic says a sticker giveaway. Yo, cuz, we told you come down the shop, bro. We'll give you two. For free. For free. Mr. Something. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna yo, can he even be a mister? The way he acts with these stickers, it's where's not, he from again? I don't think he's a mister. He's a meister. I think he's more like a He's like, you know, I don't even really know what you say. Like a junior. Something basic junior. Something basic junior. We told you something basic junior. You could come down to the shop and give you two stickers for free. Two? I only got one. And I had to pay for it. Whoa. Whoa. I did steal that t-shirt from last week, though. <laughs> so is there anything else? Carlos De La Cruz says, Vince behind you. Edge is right. Self-tappers or drillers. So... Let's do some self tappers, cuz. Let me go get the. I'll go get the studs. Hey, I'll get you. Whoa, Nick's gonna move! I can't believe it. This is good back scratch. Woo! I can't believe it. Yo, the, there you go. That's how committed Nick is. The gang said move, and Nick went and did it. 
I'm very impressed that you got him. I'm very impressed that you, they got him to, to actually move. It's unreal. Yeah. It's unreal. What are we drilling now? So we're gonna. He's gonna bring out some. Um, he's gonna bring out some steel studs or metal studs. You get a drywall gun. A drywall gun. Yeah. For what? For the studs. For what? The RPMs are failing. They want to see this. They want to see the stuff happen. Yeah. Later, Matthew. Chris Conkle. Self tappers are for the impact, says says Chris Conkle Vlogs. I don't think I've ever used. Quite frankly, I, I'm not a. I I do like my impacts somewhat. You hate impacts. The literal the, the the problem is is that because because of the shit the shit I'm used to working and all. Uh, Here. I, I really am like. The impact, it just annoys me. You want this battery on the back there? Put it back there. I thought you were getting ready to like do something with it. Uh, I got my watch because I think I was at a strip club now. You got glitter on your hands? Why, bro? What kind of dude are you? Because your, your, your wife doesn't trust you. She sees some glitter. <laughs> why would she immediately, I want to know, why would your wife immediately think, hey, were you at a strip club? Why would you say, like, I don't know. I don't were you down with, with, with your friend? Like you could be. Were you on Second Street helping out a mother's brigade or something? Or were you making arts and crafts? Why would you be making suits in July? I don't know, but I don't know why your because wife. Because I don't normally come home. Why would with, your wife? Nor, why? I want to know why your wife would immediately <laughs> think you were. The worst club. part is just glitters in your beard too. Because I tell, I, I tell my wife, oh, I'm gonna go hang out with my buddies and play with tools for a little while, and I come home wearing glitter. Uh, we need, we need self tapping. Oh man. Must have really been playing, playing hard with them oh, tools. And I'm going to be late for dinner. That's the worst part. I got the bait, bro. Yeah, you <laughs> might starve to death. What are you trying to say? Oh, nothing. Maybe if you... Unbelievable. All right, so what do you want to run here? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man. A couple of panheads. Let me see that. Panhandler. You're a panhandler. I'm telling you, next Friday we should film outside for like a half hour too. I think that would be more entertaining. I had one try to pick me up. Mary Jo says, Don't worry, I'll tell her you no, you're I doing too well. Thank you, MJ. Tell, you tell her to watch the replay. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I, I gotta tell you this. You're this so in this kit. Wow, you're. I don't know if you want to use that or not, but this is non-magnetic. That's, that's what you get. That's why with DIY. Wire. Yo, people, people want to know why. Like they're like, oh, really be I'm just a DIY wire and a homeowner. Why can't I get it done as good as a professional? Because professionals buy better toolkits that have magnets in their nut drivers so that the, it will hold the fastener. Jeez. How did we go from you playing with glitter to my wife not trusting me? You I'm, you did that to yourself. Because I'm a because I'm, I'm, because, I'm because I'm a wordsmith. That's why. I'm, why? <laughs> Where's the fleece? Because I'm a wordsmith. Is he talking about Where's real glitter or man to... glitter? Yeah. Oh, you want to put? Make sure you take a little hammer. Hammer? Guilty consciences, Carlos. Oh, no, I got... Friday glitter. Night Glitter Wars. I got Wars. glitter on me. My wife's going to think I was at a strip club. Why would you want to... I don't understand why somebody would... Like, if I went home and had glitter on me, my wife's like, are you at the shop playing with glitter again? That's what she said. Your wife says, were you at a strip club? What does that say? I don't get it. it says I don't normally play with glitter. Why not? Because I don't. You're gonna have to get it out of your beer before you leave. Yo, what are you doing? I'm putting swing on. Is that okay with you? Are we driving five? He's getting awfully touchy now, folks, isn't he? <laughs> get hangry. I'm gonna get divorced. <laughs> what was the cause of your separation? Hang, hanger. Hang, hang, hanger pain. Yes, <laughs> hanger pain. <laughs> and my buddy's un unfathomable desire to play with glitter. All right. 
You ready? This is terrible. It's horrible, right? Yeah. It's really Chris Conkle cool. said that's that's one for the waste basket right there. It literally no is. magnetic. It tip. literally, I would. It literally is. You want to swap it out for no. something that's worthwhile? It's horrible. Yo, I think you need yeah, to swap it out for something that's worthwhile. Can I throw this one out? No. Can I give it to Nick? No. You did go to the strip club, the strip screws club. <laughs> <laughs> but the way I drill, it's true. Glitter the nut driver, shaking my head. <laughs> There you go. What'd you do with it? There it is. What'd I do with what? Right there. I'll put this back. EJ and the Rainbow Club. The Rainbow Club. <laughs> Yo, the tw- the 24th Arrow Squadron. Did you get the magnetic tip? A lot of funny stories in this tunnel right now, none of which I'm allowed. What is that? A lot of funny stories in this tunnel right now, none of which I'm allowed. Here, you drill this, and I'll do that. How about that? I, I, I don't want to walk in it. It's going to be all over the place. It's going to be in my shoes, and, you know, and it's going to get in my truck. I don't, I don't want it in my truck. Put it in my truck. Right. On the count of trace. And a go, or just three? I think we just go. Because right. you're hangry. I am hangry. <laughs> Please don't. That's not good. <laughs> Pick it up. Damn you, Roger. Goodness. <laughs> I tried. It was close to the last one. We could grab it. I said, And if you like winners, make sure you smash the like button. Also, if you happen to find the channel tonight, you like Tool Wars, you like what you see, you like tool reviews, you like how to's, you like watching construction projects, make sure you get subscribed. You like also, glitter. while you're over by the subscribe button, make sure you're tapping. You're tapping the bell notification. I mean, do it in a fabulous manner. I mean, like sparkles and glitters. Make sure you hit that bell so much. Sparkles go all over the place. You get it all up in your hair. You go home. Your husband says, yo, were you at the strip club again? Or your wife or your wife says, yo, were you at the strip club again? Smash that bell notification. Let all notifications in. If you were not aware and you just got here, we're doing a giveaway. Nick, what did you do with it, Nick? I gave it away. Not yet. Just kidding. We are doing a giveaway. Make this. sure you're going over, leaving your comment, getting in, getting, what's the word I'm looking for? I'm getting saying, enrolled. Involved. Right? But get yourself at a possibly prescribe. to win this kit. Okay? You can probably find that video over here. It should be our channel trailer by now, but I'm sure Nick forgot to do that. But that's okay. You can find it. It probably says one key giveaway or whatever. Go on over there. Share out that video. Get prescribed. Never miss a daily dose. Yo, everybody, I appreciate every single one of you. Thank you to everybody that super chatted tonight. Help with the channel. Help with Tool Wars. We really appreciate it. I also appreciate the moderators for being here. And I want to say I appreciate every single one of you. Thanks, everybody. Have a good night. We'll see you on the next one. Peace out, James. Peace out. I wouldn't cut it. I wouldn't cut it so short. I would keep going. But James here is hangry, and he's got to go take a shower, get the glitter off of him. Woo! Cut it so short. Peace out, very cool gang. It's a four-hour video. Take care, Michael Spiker, Dan Soderholm. See ya, Maverick. See ya, Aaron H. See ya. No Maverick. Wayne Snoches. Where's Deacon Goose? Demon. Cad Wallader. Where's Goose? Thanks, Cad Wallader. I still keep looking for glitter. Nice small whore. Dirty Randy. Bye. Dan Soderholm. Hose them all. Philip Perkins. Dave Henning. Go. <laughs> Peace out, Demon. Peace out, Mod Squad. Thanks, very cool gang. We'll see you on the next one.